Hey guys, it's Corey. Um, I'm gonna show you guys how to write a uh, uh, tax program, a sm uh, simple tax program in Visual Basics. So, yeah, um, this is pretty much our all our codes already done. Um, first, what you would do is you have your start. And then we have print. The print will uh, display what's inside the quotation marks. So in this case, it would be type and item price. And then we have it's uh, an input. So it, and again the quotations. So press enter alone for help. And then it's saying if the amount is zero, then go to help. Um, the let tax equals amount times zero point zero five, pretty much is telling telling uh, the program that the tax amount is times zero point zero five. And then again, print the taxes, and it'll show us the tax. And then the total is, and it'll show us the total. And then if we hit the help, then it will show this much. It'll show, whoops, it'll show this. So yeah, that's pretty much our program. Um, I'll probably make a uh, a remake of this to go through it again, but I don't have much time recently. So yeah, uh, just to show you guys that it does work. Um, so type an item price, okay? Two hundred dollars. The tax is ten and the total is two ten. Okay, just to prove this theory. Uh I'm gonna get out my calculator and we're gonna go two hundred times zero point zero five and it equals ten. So then we have our tax item and again if we hit the help it tells us that what it is so we'll try a different one we're gonna put like 1244 the tax is 0 0.5 so the total is 1.05 that shouldn't be like that uh, there it is the tax is 7.2 and a hundred and fifty one dollars Again, uh, I still say it's a little bit weird, but but that is the working program working fine. So yeah, okay. Um, like I said, I'll probably make a remake of this. So yeah, okay. Ciao.